evening, viewers. Thank you for tuning in to Jeffords News. Today we cover the story of an ongoing problem that is only getting worse. Climate change has caused many problems for our world, from changes in rainfall resulting in more floods, to droughts, and even global rising temperatures. These factors are changing our world in a way where the entire environments and ecosystems are being taken off balance. This is shifting the way animals, humans, and plants function. An example of a place being affected by climate change is the island nation of Fiji, located south of the Pacific Ocean, surrounding the Kuro Sea. Reporting live, Jaden. Here in Fiji, the rapid rise in sea levels and resulting saltwater intrusion that stems from the increased ferocity of coastal floods have made portions of the island station uninhabitable. The very future of Fiji relies on climate change. Because of this, the country has signed an ERPA, Emissions Reductions Payment Agreement, that goal that's goal is to reduce carbon emissions from deforestation and forest degradation. Under Fiji's ambitious emissions reductions program, sadly, carbon emissions are not Fiji's only climate-related issue. The number of cool nights has decreased and warmer nights days and warmer days has increased since 1942. Tropical cyclones are predicted to decrease in frequency and increase in intensity. Because of these changing weather patterns, it has worsened Fiji's accessibility to viral disease outbreaks. Back to you. Thank you, Jade. Now, you at home might be thinking of ways to help fight Fiji's climate crisis, but options may be limited. Simple and easy ways to try and fight climate change as a whole include saving energy at home by either lowering your heating and cooling, switching to LED light bulbs and energy efficient electric appliances, washing your laundry with cold water, or even hanging things to dry instead of using a dryer. Secondly, instead of, try, instead of driving, try walking and biking more. This will reduce greenhouse gas emissions and benefit your health. Finally, simply eating more vegetables, whole grains, legumes, nuts, and seeds, and less meat and dairy products can significantly lower environmental impact because producing plant-based food generally results in fewer greenhouse gas emissions. That's all for tonight. Please do whatever you can to help fight climate crisis. We need all hands on deck for a mission as big as this one. And most importantly, remember the three R's. Reduce, reuse, recycle.